Norfolk police are trying to track down the person who shot a convenience store clerk. It happened early this morning at the 7-Eleven on Collie Avenue, just off of West 39th Street in Norfolk. The clerk is expected to recover, and as reporter Jonathan Costin tells us, some people in the neighborhood say the shooting does not surprise them. Police tell us it all unfolded around 3 o'clock this morning that a suspect wearing a dark sweatshirt armed with a gun walked inside the 7-Eleven and tried to stick up a clerk inside. Now, during the attempt to stick up, police tell us that the suspect shot the clerk. <gasps> I was just here. Carly DeCerci can't believe it. Someone held up the store she goes to on a regular basis here on Colley Avenue. Wow, I was here like an hour before that. That's scary. I mean, this is a fairly decent neighborhood. You know, so yeah, I'm quite quite shocked. Everybody here is uh, really hospitable. You know, you know what I'm saying. I'll go to people's houses. They offer me food, drink. Larry Roan works in this neighborhood, a transplant from the Midwest. He can't believe what happened here hours before he made his Tuesday morning rounds. Kind of surprised. Like I said, I work around here. You know, my office is around here, and I I do a lot of work in this area. So yeah, it's, it's kind of surprising because I don't have I don't have any issues over here. But several other residents who didn't want to talk on camera say the attempted armed robbery doesn't surprise them. Thomas Harris wasn't afraid to tell us what he thinks. It's a mix of a colonial place, pot place, Lambus Point, you know what I'm saying? So it's a kind of mix. So it's, 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 it's crazy. It don't surprise me, though. Not at all. In fact, Harris says violence and crime have gotten worse over the years in some neighborhoods. There's stuff going on every single day two, three, four, five times a day. We hear it all day, so it ain't really nothing new to us. It's just, um, it's just kind of sad. In Norfolk, Jonathan Costin, 13 News Now.